And what a privilege it is to be able to welcome the all-time leader in goal scoring at the Women's World Championship, Hillary Knight. How does that sound to you? Oh, boy. It sounds like I've played with a lot of great players along the way, <laughs> to be honest. No, I mean, it's, it's such an honor. And obviously, it's tough being a part of a team sport, celebrating individual milestones. I understand the gravity of it. But, um, you know, mid-tournament, we're just trying to focus on the next game. And we've got Canada coming up next. But taking the game in yesterday and last night was uh, something special, especially with this group. It's such a fun group to be around. And the energy just exudes off of both younger and older players and to celebrate a milestone with uh, Brianna Decker, one of my line mates for many years is, is an incredible moment. So Hillary, congratulations as well. I mean, it, it is quite a uh, individual achievement and I appreciate your humility, but uh, it's pretty awesome. No question about it. And you also have a pretty big game coming up right against your arch rivals. <laughs> we were joking off here. So what can we expect? Uh, tell us here. <laughs> Not an exciting game at all, right? No. <laughs> now, we haven't played each other and it feels like forever. Mm. So the blood is going to be flowing. Um, you're going to see a gritty game, a fast game, highly skilled game. Um, I'm just excited to suit up and get on the ice and um, see where we're at, to be honest. Um, but yeah, it's been, it's been a very long time. So everyone's really excited. It's been a very long time since I've seen a goal like the one you scored to set the record against Russia. And I've seen you score a lot of goals. We all have as USA hockey fans. There was so much hype surrounding you. And what I kept saying yesterday when I was talking to people after you set the record, she's exceeded the hype. And that's hard to do. How have you stayed grounded through all of this and been able to still be such a great teammate and role model for all of Team USA's fans. Yeah, no, I appreciate that. And, um, you know, that that means a lot. I, I think it's just one of these things where you want to be a student of the game. Every single day you want to come in, you want to try to get 1% better. And that's something that we harp on as a program, something that, um, you know, that I take to heart is I want to be even better than I was yesterday. And I think that's something that keeps me going. And obviously winning feels good. So continue to show up and try and do your job and fulfill your responsibilities to your teammates to put yourself in a good position to win at the end of the night. A fellow national treasure was who you passed to establish this mark, Cami Granado. The impact that she had on you, on the game, on players in general. Can you describe just how impactful Cami has been? she's a she's a magical person um both on and off the ice it's just just being in her presence is something special um it's really hard to put into words but you know a fun fun little uh fact or story was kendall Quinn and i actually went to her uh, hockey camp back in the day so she's got this gold medal she has the hockey camp and we're just like starstruck and like oh my gosh you know we want to be like that someday and that's the effect that she has on people and you know, that's just off the ice. And then on the ice, obviously, she, she puts the puck in the back of the net and she's the all-star super scorer. So, um, you know, she, she walks the talk and it's just incredible to be even mentioned in the same sentence to her. That's why I wear number 21. Mm -hmm. um, it's, just, it's a magical moment for me. That's phenomenal. And now Hillary Cammy Granado is part of the Seattle Kraken organization. And uh, that's a great thing because we're seeing more and more women be involved in the hockey operations front office or whatever it may be uh, in the National Hockey League. Does that give uh, a lot of you guys hope that uh, maybe you can follow the same path? You might be playing another 10 years. I know you've been around a long time already, but uh, what impact has Cameron Granado had from that standpoint as well? She's a trailblazer, right? And, uh, you know, I think her, her actions um, and words, I mean, she's always the pioneer for us. And so for her to have that position with the Seattle Kraken is, is tremendous. And looking forward to more women involved in the sport um, on the NHL side. And it's, it's going to be phenomenal to see how the Seattle Kraken sort of their season unfolds mm -hmm. and um, the fit there. But I'm excited because my home state's Idaho. We don't have an NHL club. So <laughs> a lot of Seattle presence in Idaho for sure. We see the A on your jersey. It was a privilege the other day to be able to talk with Kendall Coyne Schofield, and she's worked here, and everybody here just loves USA hockey. And Kendall said, thank you to NHL Network for showing all of our games, the modesty you'd expect from a hockey player. Do you understand what a big deal it is, your team, what you've done, 2018, the five straight world championships? You're in the midst of it now, kind of in the eye of the storm. 
But do you realize just how much progress you've made in popularizing and growing the sport? You know, I'd like to say yes, but no, I don't I don't think we fully grasp what we've done uh, over the, the number of years and since 2007. Um, you know, we've really been on a streak here, but, you know, it's one of those things where you show up and you just do your job and the rest is going to take care of itself. And, you know, I think uh, having Kendall at the helm and leading us is is perfect. Um, and so whatever comes our way, we adjust and we adapt and we move forward. But yeah, I think I think a few years from now when we step back from the ice, we're going to be like, OK. You know, that was pretty special, but as <laughs> yeah. we, we just try to focus on who we have, you know, the next night or what we're doing today um, to try and not, you know, feed into the hype, but it's definitely there, right? This is a tremendous program, an incredible team. And I think that's why I keep showing up every day, right? I, I just want to be a part of it um, because it is truly something special. Team USA is very fortunate that you keep showing up every day. <laughs> we loved having you on the show. Good luck against Team Canada and continued success. Thank you, guys.